Saanich woman is helping transgender people all over the world to find their voice. It's an integral part of who we are, and Jessica Bard is volunteering her time to help others after her own difficult journey. Tess Van Stratton introduces us to her in this week's Vital People. I want you to start by whispering. My name is Jess Gibbard, and I teach trans voice on my website, transvoicecoach.com. And then the voice starts to sound more like this. But I do more free work than I do paid work. And the reason that I do that is because I really just want this to be accessible to as many people as possible. Hi, how are you? Most of my clientele are off the island. A lot of them are from all around the world. All right, so what I'd like you to do this time is I'd like you to start with the lower tone that you're using. It's really important to trans people like myself just to be able to find a voice that feels more comfortable, that doesn't put us in risk, um, you know, out in public, to be able to pass more like the person that we want to be. Transphobia is a real risk that we do face day to day, and having our voices match the person that we're appearing as is really important to us. And so with the human voice, there are a few malleable resonances that we can control. When I first came out, I didn't have enough money to pay for a voice coach, and I didn't have the time to wait that one year for the TransCare BC program. So I kind of just had to teach myself. I spent a lot of time researching how resonance works in singing. I learned that the human voice is very similar to, say, like a bottle. If you were to blow air over the top of a bottle, it would produce a pitch. And the more air that is available in the bottle, the lower the pitch is going to be. And so with the human voice, the more air that's available in the resonance chamber, the lower the tone will be, even if the tone that's being produced is the same pitch. So those are the same pitches. And these two resonances here have dropped, and then they've risen back up. Volunteering is a really important thing for me with this voice training, just because, like myself, there are many other people who otherwise can't afford voice coaching. And it's such an integral, vital aspect of who we are as a person. Having the voice that is your voice is just, it's, it's an unparalleled feeling. It feels really nice being able to make a difference like this. Growing up, I always wanted to have a job where I could actually make an impact directly on other people's lives. Words can't really describe it. It's, it's un, unreal. Vital People, brought to you by the Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.